What is up you geezer blowtie geezers and it's Chris Modder Games here. Alright, so I'm gonna do a video talking about a specific topic for Overwatch. But before I do that, I would just like to take this really short opportunity to apologize uh, for not making very many videos lately. Um, the reason for this is because I've been doing other projects in the background and I've literally have not had any time to just sit here and make videos and even plan them out. Yeah, if, if there's for any reason I just don't make a video for the next like four days or what have you, it's probably because I'm busy doing other bits and pieces. Uh, and I really, really do apologize for that because, you know, I, I still enjoy doing this channel and I'm sure that you guys watch my videos and enjoy them as well. So, yeah, like I said, I, I have had plans to do other videos as well. Like, I need to do a retro games video. I've got to do another episode of the Overwatch playthrough series. I've got to do a loot box opening for um, the archives event for this year. I mean, there's, there's loads of videos for me to do. I've just not had a chance to sit down and actually just plan anything. Yes, it. I'm sorry for the people that have just sat and ex hopefully was expecting a video from me. And thank you to those people that have actually subscribed to me recently as well. Um, I really do highly appreciate it. We're way, way past 1,700 subscribers now. I'm looking to get 1,800 on the board. So let's see if we can make that a reality. Anyway, with that said... We're going to go ahead and talk about the topic for this video. It's going to be an Overwatch talk video. Now, I'm a little bit late to the party with this. The first time this was mentioned was probably about a week ago. But I really wanted to sort of talk about it because I I'm actually really hyped about this. I really am. So what you can see here, as you can see, I'm on the, I'm on the Overwatch League website right now. Now, what it is, it's the Overwatch League All-Stars. Los Angeles 2019. Now, the difference with this is, if you remember last year in the Overwatch League, the Overwatch All-Star game happened after the season had finished. This time around, the All-Stars event is happening during. So, right here, what we have is we have a massive, huge thing that Blizzard are promoting. They've got two skins that are going to be based on the event. So, we have a Pacific Lucio skin, and we have a Atlantic Mercy skin. Now, if you remember last year, they had an Atlantic Tracer and a Pacific Genji. And this was all due to the, you know, just looking at the actual thing itself. There were a couple of games that were being played. You had to vote what players in the Overwatch League that you wanted to see during the all-star game and yeah they just played a, like a bunch of game modes and you know everyone was having a lot of fun you know it's atlantic division versus the pacific division i do believe atlantic kind of won I mean, I mean i'm an atlantic fan because you know it's london spitfire a part of the atlantic division but anyway <laughs> so as you can see lucio and mercy right here i'm not going to play the video because you know copyright and all the rest of it i don't even know if this this video is going to be able to play because well my internet down here is absolutely terrible. But it shows here that the event is going to happen between Wednesday, May the 15th at 6pm and Thursday, the May the 16th at 6pm. So it's going to be between those dates and those times. Now then, the skins, like the Tracer and Genji skins last year, they're going to be 200 tokens each. So if you've got 200 tokens lying around in your account, you'll be able to buy at least one of these. Now, the only ways you can get tokens in this game, or the only ways you can get tokens to purchase the skins, are two ways. One, you just basically watch Overwatch League on Twitch. Now, the only way you can watch them on Twitch is basically you just link up your Blizzard account with a Twitch account, and then you watch Overwatch League with that account, and then you start getting tokens onto your account, I think. I think that's how that works. And then once you do that, once you get to about 200 uh, 200 tokens, I guess you'll be able to buy one of these skins. I've actually got more than 200 tokens already saved up on my account. So I'm probably going to be buying the Mercy skin when it does, well, when, when these when both these skins come out. I really do like the Mercy skin. It's, it's absolutely amazing. Let's see if I can actually get this. Hold on. Um, I think there's a picture here. Where is it? Here we go. So... This is amazing. Just look at that. That is such an amazing looking skin. I'm going to be getting this. When the skins come out, I'm definitely going to get this. I'm not too sure about the Lucio one, though. I I mean, each to their own and everything. But I just feel the Lucio skin is a bit over-designed. That's just my opinion, right? I mean, if you've got a completely different opinion to me, if you're going to buy this Lucio skin, 
If you've got enough tokens, then by all means get it and you know, you'll be you'll be able to do whatever the hell you want with it. But I just feel that the Lucio skin is a little bit over designed for my liking. The Mercy skin though, oh, that is just, it is just, just ridiculous. It's amazing. It's just so good. I, I like it so much. Uh, let's see if we can find a better image of this. Uh, let's see. You know what? I'm not even. I'm not even. Gonna, I'm not even going to bother looking at it, to be honest, or checking it. So these are the these are the exhibition matches that are going to be played out. So you've got the All Star Arcade. So I'm I'm assuming. All right. So these are all the the arcade modes. So you've got to vote for these. Thanks, but no tanks. Six v six, no tanks. Uh, keeping the peace, McCree only. Healers never die. 6v6 supports only. Terrible, terrible damage. Uh, 6v6 damage only. Heavy metal, tanks only. New blood. So basically what you do is you vote for the ge your favourite game modes, basically. I would like to see some heavy metal. I've got to be honest. I do like tanks only. Maybe. Let's have a look at some... Maybe some tanks. Um, what did you call it? I can't remember. What, ha what ever happened to mystery heroes, anyway? I wanted to see more mystery heroes. Why isn't this not like an option? Otherwise, I would have probably voted for that. So yeah, you got talent takedown as well. Uh, so Atlantic and Pacific Division coaches will draft teams of Overwatch League casters and analysts from three maps. Ah, right. So I, I, I reckon this is where you get the people. You know, you know the guys on the desk when they when they when they're sort of analysing every game. So Braincasts, Sideshow, Zoe, guys like Monte Cristo. You know, these guys they'll probably be playing against each other like we did last time. I think the Pacific Division won that. <laughs> Even though we all think... We, we all know that Atlantic is better than Pacific anyway. <laughs> That's just me being biased. But um, yeah, I mean, this will be the talent takedown anyway. And then you've got the Widowmaker 1v1. Which is basically just some of the best Widowmaker players playing against each other. Um, I don't remember who won last time. I think... I honestly don't know. I think Shawfall won it. Yeah, I, I think he did. I, correct me if I'm wrong. I think Shawfor from the LA Gladiators won it. But um, the Widowmaker players will be playing against each other in this. So, yeah. This is pretty much it. This is what um, this is what Blizzard are promoting. These, these skins, uh, the Overwatch All-Star event. It happens on May the 15th. I'm assuming that that's when the skins will become available. And then we'll be able to buy them for like 200 tokens. I'm not sure about the Tracer and the Genji skins from last time. I, I mean, if they don't become available as well, that would be a bit weird. Maybe have them at 100 tokens each instead of 200 because they were available last time. I don't know. Obviously, the most recent ones, Mercy and Lucy, will probably be like 200. You know, let's just see what happens, really. So, I, th I think those are going to be the skins that are available around about that time. So, you know, if you've got a few tokens lying around. Oh, the other ways of getting a tokens, by the way, is if you just pay them with real money. Uh, but I don't do that. <laughs> <laughs> I, I completely forgot to say that before when I was talking about the, the, the two different ways that you can actually get tokens. So the first way of getting tokens is by watching Overwatch League itself. I think with every map that gets played out, you get, I think, two or three tokens per map. I could be wrong. But yeah, that's that, that's that option. And obviously the other option is by paying... Um, Blizzard real money for, for, for actual tokens. So, so there you go, guys. That's pretty much my analysis on the whole situation. The whole um, Overwatch League All-Stars. It's happening on the 15th of May. Uh, so there you go, guys. So there you go. That's a video, guys. I, I'm, a, I'm sorry that it's a little bit uh, all over the place. I mean, I'm trying to get back into making a video again uh, after about a couple of days off. <laughs> Uh, so I will be making more videos guys. I want to do another retro games video I want to get um, a loot box opening done for overwatch archives Maybe another episode of the overwatch playthrough series possibly a video on paladins or maybe something from uh, Apex legends. I don't even know to be honest with you. I'm look. I'm trying to get back into it slowly I mean, I've 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 had some other projects to do and you know just coming back trying to make a video again It's 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 very difficult if, if, if you know the stress of being a YouTuber. So if you just stick around, if you stay with me, I'm going to do much more content after this. I mean, if it takes me about maybe three or four days to make another video, then <laughs> I don't even know what this video is, is anymore. But anyway, thank you very much for watching this video, guys. If you enjoyed it, please like, comment, subscribe, follow me on Twitter at chrisman 9 Check me out on my Google, Facebook, Pinterest, Twitch, and of course, my eBay store. Make sure you click on the notification bell if you want to be updated with any videos. I do intend to do in the future. <laughs> Have a great day. Have a great life. Be nice, you fellow gamers. Because we're all human beings, I've been Chris Modder Games. Until the next video, I shall see you later. Hey, door. And peace.